In this video, I'm going to share with you five things that no one really expects in retirement, but things that can completely derail your retirement plan, maybe even destroy your retirement savings without you really thinking about them or planning for them. Hi, I'm Camille Gaines here and on my website, retiresurgeon.com, I write about and talk about investing and creating income streams in retirement this is what I love to do. It interests me. I'm not trying to t sell you wealth management services. I just like talking about investing and financial information and I think it's super, super, super important. So in this video, I want to share with you these five things that nobody really plans for that can totally destroy your retirement plan. Now, if you like this type of information after you see my video, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Click that little like uh, hands up below the video if you want to see my videos that are new in your newsfeed. That is, if you like my content. Okay, so the first thing that nobody counts on is getting hit with a big tax bill. In other words, making a mistake on your taxes. This can be a huge, huge setback in retirement. Nobody plans on getting hit with this. Now, the real problem is that, well, there are several problems. First of all, you get hit with a big penalty if you make a mistake on your taxes and you get audited. Then the next thing is you can get, you have to pay years worth of interest on the amount that you owe. And then the next thing is you have to pay somebody to help you figure all this out. Now, while you may be able to go it alone, if you do get audited and depending on the complexity of your books, you may want to bring in a CPA or someone that is an expert in resolving audit issues and dealing with audits not only all of these expenses, but it takes a lot of time and energy to get audited and to get everything together, to meet with the IRS. It can really be a timely energy zapping process. So just be super, super careful when you do your taxes. I'm all for taking advantage of everything that we can certainly legitimately take advantage of in the tax code. The tax code is written to promote certain things, many things. You know, we have retirement accounts, we have favorable tax rates for dividends, for capital gains, for real estate, for small business. There's so many ways that we can take advantage of those tax savings. And I'm all for that. I promote getting a great book and learning about this so that you can pay as low a tax as possible because that's the biggest expense that many people have, uh, certainly during their lifetime, maybe not as bad in retirement since their income is significantly lower. But getting hit with a tax bill in retirement for mistakes that you've made can be a real, real, game changer. It can really be detrimental. So be really careful when you do your income taxes. The next completely unexpected problem or surprise that hits people in retirement is a lawsuit. Wow. Thank goodness we have insurance that can help us protect ourselves from lawsuits. There are so many lawsuits constantly happening in the United States. After living overseas for many years, I really, really came to um, see this, how problematic it is in our country. I get to say that because I am an American. One thing that you may want to consider, depending on how much money you have, is some sort of umbrella policy. An umbrella policy takes care of you where the other policies drop off. You know, if you've reached that maximum amount, and umbrellas are relatively cheap for the amount of insurance coverage that you get. So look into an umbrella if you don't already have one, and this may be something that you want to get. The next problem in retirement or surprise in retirement that can completely destroy your retirement plan is a big one, and that is divorce. After retirement, a lot of people that end up getting divorces because people that have been working and distracted with their work their whole lives and maybe dealing with children and family, they just really haven't, you know, uh, addressed the issues in their marriage. And divorce rate is high in retirement. So one thing you want to make sure of is that you take care of your marriage if you are married. 
divorce is incredibly problemat bleh, problematic because it doubles the cost of all your living expenses. Not only this, the cost of divorce itself can be, uh, the emotional and the financial cost can be horrible. So make sure that you take care of your marriage if you are married. And if you're thinking about getting married, just make sure this is the right thing for you to do at this point in your life. The next big surprise that can destroy your retirement plan is something coming up with family needs that you hadn't really planned on. Someone in your family needs your help and you don't have the money set aside to deal with this. This is really, really a tough one because we're encouraged uh, to take care of ourselves as parents and or as children. We have to do this. It's like the oxygen mask that we have to put on ourselves first before we can help anyone else. But we all know most of us love our family very, very much. And when something comes up, sometimes we need to help family members. And that's going to take money that we had not planned on using to help that person. And that can really, really destroy a retirement plan that was otherwise very, very solid. And then the last thing I want to mention, the last surprise that can hit us in retirement is a really, really big one. I've talked about it here in other videos, and that is major changes in the economy, in the financial markets that we hadn't really planned on. Very, very few people plan for this. Recency bias, and that is just a term in behavioral finance that leads us to think that what happened, what has happened lately, will continue happening into the future. And we just sort of make that assumption. It feels like things won't change. But if we look back at history, it's taught us many, many times that things do change. And in the economy, there are very, very long, you know, 40, 50 year cycles that can have a dramatic impact on our finances in retirement. For example, interest rates as of this recording have recently ended a 40 year interest rate cycle of declining interest rates. And when interest rates are declining, then that's a friendlier env environment for stocks to increase in value. And not only that, declining interest rates increases the cost, the price, the value of bonds because those bonds have a stated, a fixed interest rate on them that investors it's no longer, they can get a better rate, in other words, if interest rates go up. So that makes the price of bonds go down. But if interest rates are falling, then bonds go up in value. And so we have those two huge factors that are supporting our stocks and bonds to increase in value. And when those cycles end, those long-term changes happen, it can really play havoc on our retirement savings. Not only that, inflation. Yeah, inflation can, as we've seen lately as of this recording, really, really uh, raise its nasty head and double, triple. We even had uh, very, very high inflation in the early 1980s, over 13%. So can you imagine from one year to the next in retirement, the price of your cost of living, what it takes for you just to live, increasing by 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 percent. That's crazy. So make sure that when you do your planning for retirement, you factor in these possibilities. Now, of course, divorce, needing a, to help a family member, a tax mistake, uh, these types of things, there's just no way that they can possibly be planned for. The changes in, in the financial and economic environment, those things can be planned for. If we just look at history and we can see that these things have happened before. And I like to always say, where are we now and what's logical that will happen going forward? Because, well, for example, we know if interest rates are 
1%, 2% as they were recently, they really can go much lower. So take a look at where we are, take a look at what's happened in the past and factor that into your retirement planning. And these other things that you can't really expect, sort of be prepared, work around them. Liability insurance, for example, that's certainly something that we can protect ourselves uh, from a liability with that insurance. So that's what I want to share with you in this video. If you found this information helpful, make sure you subscribe and remember, retire certain.